Good evening and salutations. Um, back with another vlog. It's kind of weird. Um, I'm probably actually gonna put this one out tonight because this is more of a night vlog. So, um, I'm actually got off on Sunday, and this isn't like something I requested. You just gave me off on Sunday. I'm surprised. Um, I'm happy. I get to get some more work done. Um, from home, so that's good. Uh, let's see. What did I do today? Well, I did a vlog in the morning, obviously. And I think I watched something. No, I did a vlog in the morning. And then I did another, I did a review, which I'm going to put out tomorrow. I'm going to put that out tomorrow. Hold on one sec. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, what did I do? I woke up at, like... 8.30 today. I woke up super early um, for a Saturday, for me anyway. Um, you know, my history of waking up has been like, on a, on a weekday and a weekend is like 11 o'clock. I, I um, generally like to catch up on sleep. And um, I don't know, I just, I woke up super early today because I've been waking up all week for work, like really early and shit. Um, so I just got used to it. I just got used to waking up really early. So I woke up around like 8, 8.30 and um, I stayed in the bed till like around like 9.45. I don't know. Mentally, I just was not ready to get up. Physically, I was good, but mentally, I just was not good um, as far as just being up at that time. Um, so I stayed in bed. I watched Paranormal Activity, a little bit of that. That movie is just, yeah. Anyway, I heard, you know, aside now, I heard they're actually going to be making another one. So that's interesting. Um, so let's see. Woke up, got breakfast, did a vlog, came back. I think I did two videos and um, hung out with my dad for a little bit. Okay, so here's the thing. I love my dad like nobody's business. I love my dad to death. So, you know, when I tell this story, this isn't to, like, poke fun at him or anything like that or whatever. But, um, let me just turn this off real quick. Sorry about that. So, um, yeah, I love my dad to death. So, I was sitting with my dad in the living room. And we were sitting there talking for a little bit. And, um, you know, my dad asked me, he was like, so, you know, are you planning on doing anything else today? Like, you know... I was like, no, not really. He was like, so you're not, he was like, so you're not like going out anywhere or anything like that. And I stood there and I looked at him and I was like, in my head, I'm like, there's a fucking pandemic going on. And you literally just asked me, am I actually going back out later on today? Like, Here's the thing. I'm not one of those type of people that's like, you know, being very fearful of this thing or anything like that. But I'm being smart about it. And, you know, I feel like if I don't actually have to go out, why am I going out for? Besides, there's really nothing to do, even if I do go out. And, um, you know, me and my dad, you know, we're both like essential workers and stuff like that. Well, we are essential workers. Um, so, you know, I was sitting there talking to my dad and... You know, you know, he tells me sometimes that, you know, after he gets off, you know, gets off work or whatever, you know, he goes to the park, you know, just to walk around and stuff like that. And I'm like, listen, I'm not sitting there telling people, you know, not to go out and not exercise and stuff like that. You know, I think I was just more like, you know, you going or like hanging around other people and stuff like that. But um, my, my point was, you know, if you don't actually have to go out, don't go out. You know, I'm just stay at home, you know, and it's, <clears throat> I know, I've been, here's the thing, I did a video a while back and I'm not going to lie, it, it, the shit that I said in that video, this was about the, you know, don't scare other people with the quarantine or something like that. And, um, I was saying a lot of reckless shit. I was saying a lot of reckless shit. I think this is mostly just because of the fact that people were panicking and it annoyed the hell out of me. Here's the thing. There, 
It's a, there's a fine line between being afraid and panicking. And I feel like panicking in any situation does no one any good ever. Um, but the panicking shit was just really irritating me. And I said a lot of shit that, well, was just really fucking ignorant and dumb. Um, I was talking about just go out and live your best life and stuff like that. And just really dumb shit. Um... And, you know, I changed my tune, um, you know, because, you know, at work and stuff like that, I deal with people and stuff, and people were just telling me all these really sad stories about how people, you know, like, somebody was going to tell me that they had a brother that passed away, and <sighs> just hearing that, just, and I, I get a lot of stories like that, you know, people talk about, you know, their loved ones are sick and stuff like that, and. You know, when you hear it from somebody, when you hear it, it's, here's the thing. It's a lot different when you are watching the news and you're hearing people talk about people are deaf and the death toll and stuff like that. And it's kind of a distance thing because, you know, you don't really know these people and stuff. And granted, I don't know the customers and stuff like that that I deal with, but to see their faces and hear it in their voice and, you know, to see the sadness, it's it hits you. You know, it hits you. It's, it's it's a lot more personal when, you know, you're talking to somebody and they've been personally affected by this whole thing. I'm not going to say a name because in the future I want to get monetized. So, yeah. Um. So, yeah, you know, I was just not there telling my dad, you know, just like, just be smart about it. You know, I tell him, you know, wear your mask. Again, I'm not going to lie. Um, I actually have not been wearing the gloves, but I do wash my hands when I get home. Um, I'll just tell him just, you know, wear his mask and stuff like that. It's going to be around, you know, my dad, I think for me, I was just being overprotective and just whatever, you know, when he told me that he was going to the park, I was like, what are you nuts? Like there's a pandemic, but <clears throat> you can't stop people from living their lives to some extent. And the only thing you can sit there and do is hope that they're going to be smart about it. Um, and I was, I was giving my dad a lot of shit and it's just mostly just me being overprotective because. In reality, he was being smart. He wasn't around a lot of people. He was just, you know, taking a walk, just sitting in the park or whatever, just kind of collect his thoughts before he, you know, comes home and stuff. Um, but yeah, it's just a simple fact that he was like, you know, he was, I don't want to sit there and say he wasn't taking it seriously, but when he was hearing people talk about how they were just staying home and stuff like that, it's like, oh, these people are boring. They're just boring. Just, just staying home, not doing anything, not going anywhere. And my head was like, where the fuck is anyone going? You know, there's no bars open. There's no movie theaters open. Like, where is anyone going? Where is anyone going? No one's going anywhere. So, like... You know, the fact that he wasn't there saying that shit, I was just like... Dad, I love you. With that being said, you have no idea how idiotic you sound. I'm going to love you anyway, but, um, yeah, you're, you're not, you're not really, um, it, it, just the whole thing is just sounding really dumb. Um, anyway, I think that's just my little story time. I, you know, I have to tell you, if I'm not even going to call it a vlog, I'm just going to call it a, um, I'm call it a story time. I'm going to start doing those on Sundays, just, you know, little personal stories and stuff like that, that's. Happened to me or this going on throughout the week or whatever. Um, I was doing another segment on Sundays. Um, you know, like hot topics of the week and stuff like that. And sometimes I was actually getting a lot of views and sometimes I really wasn't getting a lot of views. Um, so I figured, you know, I kind of just dive a little more deep or whatever and just do like my personal story times and stuff like that. And just things that's happened to me, um, just little personal things that's, you know, I go through throughout the week or whatever and, um... Yeah, so I'm gonna start doing those. I'm gonna start doing those on Sundays. I'll probably bring back the here's the thing. If people will actually want to hear, you know, me to do the um hot topics and stuff like that, I'll still do those. Um, but I'm gonna try this segment out and um see how people like it and people if they don't like it. Tell me why. Um, write in the comment section. Let me know how you're doing. You know, any crazy stories that's going on during your time during this whole um you know, craziness. 
this video is probably going to get demonetized because I'm pretty sure I said the P word. Um, but moving forward, um, yeah, so just let me know your stories, as what's going on with you, how are you dealing with this stuff, any crazy stories that's, that's, that's been happening to you, long lines at different places, people being angry, you know, just, I want to, I want to hear, you know, I want to hear it, um, anyway, that's going to do it for this, um, story time, since I just kind of coined, I didn't really coin the phrase, but like, as I was doing this video, I was thinking, think, I was like, you know what, it's actually going to be kind of an interesting thing, um, interesting new segment, so, YouTube has been really interesting, um, again, Thank you for the people that's watching. Thank you for the subscribers. I really do appreciate it. Um, and I don't want to be one of those people that's sitting there bragging. Well, I mean, seriously, who can really brag at like 69 um, subscribers? But I'm actually really happy about that. Because um, that just means that 65, 69 people like my videos. And, um, you know. So, anyway. This video is getting really long. And um, it's... it's it's one of those spontaneous videos that I was like, you know what, I was on Instagram Live, no one was on there, so I was like, you know what, I still have a lot of shit to say, and, um, yeah, so, um, have a great night, if you're watching this at night, well, I'm probably gonna put this on, I'm actually gonna put this out on Sunday, so, um, hope everyone's having a great night, being safe, all that good stuff, listen, if people don't like the closing um, segment that I do, please let me know. I'll try changing something else. But until then, um, if you don't have to go out, stay your ass home. And, um, wash your goddamn hands. Be safe. And I will see you in the next video.